Hello, Namaste, Privet Ola. This is Valencia. Welcome to my channel. And today, from, from London, London, I am heading to Tower Bridge. Tower Bridge is one of the most famous bridges in London, and I've heard a lot about it and seen it in movies and photos and stuff like that. Today, I'm going to see it. I'm at a random bus station, and I need to figure out how to get there. Does this go to Tower Bridge? Tower Bridge. No? Which one? Which one goes? No idea. Uh, Sorry? No, I want to get to Tower Bridge. Do you know how do I get to Tower Bridge? Um, go that way, get across that way. Straight? No, yeah. Why? Fuck. Everyone's telling me something else, like someone's saying stand here, someone's saying on the left. Boy, that's why I walk, man. That's why I walk. I don't understand, like these buses are so confusing. And the underground is even more. Like I thought I'd take the underground, but like that's even more confusing. Well, I've changed my mind because I don't want to lose the light and I will be losing the light in the next two and a half hours. So I've planned to go to Big Ben. Big Ben is the big clock that they have in London and they also have uh, the London Eye. We also have the same eye in Dubai. So apparently London Eye built it first and then it was built by Dubai. But in size, Dubai is much more bigger than London. I'm like 14 minutes away now. Oh my god, it's so windy. Oh, the best part about this place is that I don't really see many homeless people. Maybe like one or two on the streets. But nothing, nothing crazy. I like such white buildings that they have a white architecture. I think it was back in the day, like it's so well constructed and uh, looks very Roman style. I don't know, I find it really fascinating because I haven't really grown up seeing it and now that I see it, I feel like I used to see this back in the day on television and things like that. So, something really cool here. Wow. Is it like a traditional thing. Does anyone know what this is? Because I don't. There are so many people around. I feel so bad for the horse. Security is literally everywhere on the streets. Is it like a main street or something? Because there are so many police vans here. So many police vans. This is what happens when you don't have anyone to take photos of you. You just like walk around and show videos of yourself. Oh god, I miss this so much. I wish there was someone to take a photo of me at least. But it really feels so good. It looks like a beautiful monument. I don't know how old it is, but I'm going to try to find some information and some facts about it. Just above us there, you can notice there's glass panels in the floor, so if you go up there, you can see the boats as they pass underneath you. Do please be careful though, folks, when you look up through those glass panels. We travelled under the bridge the other day, and there's having a Scottish wedding up there. That was truly a sight to see. So finally made it to the Tower Bridge. I, I I really feel like I'm so lucky in this case because I I don't know. Like I just feel like I should have just uh, I don't know what to say. So uh, I wanted to see this bridge and I'm uh, finally here. But I was so excited that I literally recorded all my videos in time lapse and. I don't know, like all my conversations with random people and stuff like that, 
all gone, literally all gone. I did see like a board that said Tower Bridge and I went over, asked the counter and I got something like that with a bill. I got like a souvenir with a bill. A return ticket back again to London Eye from the Tower Bridge cost £18 or something and one way would be approximately £9. So I took a return back because obviously I don't want to get lost again. Yes. So I'm on the bridge right now and it's just another bridge but it looks so cool. I think I'll just be walking this way. It's like a miracle. It's, it's like I really did want to come to Tower Bridge and I did not know that there's a connection from London Eye to Tower Bridge. It's total bliss. So beautiful. Yeah, but the water is really good. But I'm a little disappointed because I literally shot the whole thing in time lapse and um, I mean, it's fine. Everything is just so perfect. Like the weather, it's about to rain, it's cloudy now. So, but I'm happy, I'm so happy, I'm so happy I did not take the bus. I, I don't know what to say, like everything really happens for a reason um, and I don't know, I just don't know what to say, it's like a falling short of words. So um, yeah, and a lot of buses like that, that they're literally all over London, you know, they're tourist buses. Um, so yeah, I'm glad I went to Big Ben and then I went to London Eye, got a connecting ferry from there and I'm here. So uh, they do have something like this on the streets. Brits Master. So I don't know what are these names, I think they are the people who are who have literally what? There's a navy. So I think they are like some uh, big people or like famous people. They've carved their names on the bridge. Uh, so it's just perfect view. So I'm just going to be chilling around this area for a while to see what they have. And uh, I'm just minding my step for it. <laughs> The bridge looks so cool from here, literally. It's so, it's such a good view. So I think there are like cafes here and then there are, there's like a bridge view, very cool. I think I need a photo, like I need to ask someone to take a photo of me. I'm glad I took a photo because I literally don't have photos on this trip. I have no photos. So it's getting dark now and I have to head back to the ferry because I've taken a return ticket. Uh, it says that the boat leaves in the next 40 minutes. So I think I've crossed my 40 minutes limit because I was just like chilling and you know, looking around. But uh, yeah, now I'm going to be heading towards the bridge and then I have to go down to the ferry. I hope I've not lost the ferry because I don't know how often does it go. I'm really hungry now, but I have to head to the ferry. So.
Peanuts. I don't like peanuts. Ice cream. Should I get an ice cream? But it's freezing. Can I have a three hot dogs, please? Yeah. I would like to have a single with flakes. <laughs> Oh, sorry. <laughs> Yummy. Best weather to have an ice cream. Walking to the other side of the bridge. Now, I don't know, they dropped me there and I have to go the other side to take another ferry. Uh, I think I see it. It's right there. That's the ferry I have to go to. So, getting cold. So, it's always good to just go with the flow, you know. Especially when you don't have plans. I think that's the best thing to do. And as a solo traveler in London, it's not that difficult or it's not that bad. You can always, always have more options like take the trains, take the bus, the ferry. The ferry obviously is limited to certain uh, destinations, but otherwise, it's all fun. Okay, now I'm on the other side of the bridge, and I'm gonna find now uh, find where my ferry actually stations. Oh, found it. It's called James River. I don't know if the ferry is already here, but I think I'll have to wait because I don't see anyone here. Yeah, there's I think a waiting period. Shit. So, did you see, it's so dark, but the London Bridge is so beautiful at this time. The lights, the lights make everything look so good. Yeah. River. Right, so it's this one. I think we'll have to stay stay here, but show where the ship is gonna. Yeah, it, yeah, because I asked there in the in the, in the, the football shop if it's near here. Yeah. I'll have to wait. Finally in my boat. It was open so I came up to see. Woo. been a lovely lovely day um, I did get lost like a million times and then I found my way out so I think everything is doable and I'm so happy um, I'm literally on a ferry right now in the middle of, of, of the river it's so cold just the perfect thing to do just the perfect weather I'm just gonna enjoy this beautiful beautiful weather and uh, the scenery right in front of me